Hi everyone, welcome back to Simple Innovation. In this video, I'm gonna show you step-by-step -step tutorial on how to publish sensor readings from XDK Bosch to Kubitro IoT platform through MQTT protocol. Kubitro is the fastest way to build IoT applications with predictable pricing, developer-friendly features, and scalability you will love. You can connect your hardware to Kubitro, collect the data, and create data visualization on your own dashboard. For more information about Kubitro, you can check on its official site, kubitro.com. On this video, I'm gonna use the XDK Bosch, an all-in-one IoT solution from Bosch based on 32-bit microcontroller ARM Cortex-M3, which has Bluetooth 4.0 low energy, wireless local area network, and also internal lithium-ion battery. It also has several built-in sensors like accelerometer, gyroscope, magnetometer, temperature sensor, air pressure, humidity, and light sensor. For more information about XDK Bosch, you can check on its official site, developer.bosch.com. On this tutorial, I will demonstrate how to publish sensor readings from XDK Bosch to Kubitro IoT platform through MQTT protocol. To code my XDK Bosch, I'll use its official IDE, Integrated Development Environment, named the XDK Workbench, using Eclipse Meta Programming Language, a high-level language that transpiles into C code. First, I will read all values of its built-in sensors, then make them as a JavaScript object notation or JSON string. Next, I'm gonna connect my XDK to the internet through Wi-Fi and publish the data to Kubitro MQTT broker. And finally, we will create charts for data visualization on my Kubitro dashboard. So without any further ado, let's get started. First, let's create a project on Kubitro. On kubitro.com homepage, click go to portal link and sign up or log in with your Kubitro account. Then create a new project and define your project's name and description. Click create project button. After that, let's create our device. Choose a connectivity method. In this case, I'll choose MQTT. Click continue and I'll enter my device information from device name, description, model, and location. Then click continue button. At this point, you will get your MQTT credentials to connect to Kubitro MQTT broker. Please take note of these values host, port, username, password, and client ID because we will use it on our code later. You can check these values on your device settings menu. The username and client ID are your Kubitro device ID and the password is your Kubitro device token. Next, let's code our XDK Bosch using Eclipse Meta on XDK Workbench IDE. If you don't have this IDE, you can download from the link below. Here is the XDK's Workbench welcome screen. Click on Use Eclipse Meta button, wait, and you will be redirected to the XDK's workspace template. After that, let's connect the XDK Bosch to our laptop on bootloader mode. To do that, press button 1, button with a dot on top of it, plug in the micro USB cable to our XDK, then switch the XDK on. You will see your XDK status on XDK Workbench. Connect it, and it's on bootloader mode. Now time for coding. Go to application.meta file editor. First, I'll declare some resources for XDK's built-in sensors, accelerometer, gyroscope, light sensor, and environment sensor. I will also define Wi-Fi resource where my XDK will be connected to. I will enter my SSID or Wi-Fi name and its password. Next resource is the Kubitro MQTT broker. I will include my MQTT credentials from Kubitro here. The URL is broker.kubitro.com on port 1883. The client ID, username, and topic are my Kubitro device ID, and the password is my Kubitro device token. Then I will create an event. Every 5 seconds, my XDK will read all the sensor values, map them as JavaScript object notation or JSON string, then publish to Kubitro MQTT broker. Done. 
let's build the project click project and choose build project once done click flash button to upload the code into the xdk post you can check your xdk activities on xdk workbench console now every five seconds our xdk will publish the data to kubitro let's go back to kubitro to see the data streams from our xdk Go to your device section at Kubitro portal and you will see the data streams on data tab. The data comes from XDK Bosch. Now go to analytics tab where you can create charts for your data. To create a chart, simply just choose the variables that you want to be visualized, choose its color and chart type line chart, area, or bar color. This analytics tab only visualizes the data stream from specific device on your specific project. If you have more than one project or one device and you want to create a centralized data visualization, you can create your own dashboard on Kubitro. To create Kubitro dashboard, go to monitoring section. Create new dashboard, give it a name and once your dashboard is created, you can add some widgets. To create a widget, click Add Widget button, give it a name, choose the origin project, device, and its type. There are a lot of widget types you can use in Kubitro. After that, click Continue, choose the variables that you want to be visualized. Repeat the same to create another widget, as simple as that. A simple tutorial on how to publish sensor readings from XDK Bosch to Kubitro IoT platform through MQTT protocol. The source code can be cloned from my GIST GitHub. Link is on the description below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you.